Hey guys, welcome back to LS Vintage Design. I'm Lisa. How's everyone doing today? I hope you're having an amazing day. If you're new to my channel, welcome. And if you keep coming back, thank you. If you haven't yet, but you keep watching my videos, go ahead and hit the subscribe button with the little bell. That way you'll just know when new videos pop up, but it won't be annoying. Today we're going to talk about ideas for vintage art that are affordable and you can find anywhere or almost anywhere. So let's just jump into our video. So say you want to decorate your home with some vintage art, but it's way too overpriced right now. What are some options for you? Well, you could use vintage magazines, whether you use it for the fashion. You could also do something like that. You could use vintage advertising for the products. The um, You could use something like vintage advertising. That's always an option. Other things are vintage calendars. You know, you can find vintage calendars that are animals, that are florals, scenes. So there's a lot of options. You could use vintage sewing pattern envelopes, vintage pages from a book, vintage dust jackets, vintage game pieces. You could use unusual things like vintage green stamps. Vintage advertisements, again. You could use vintage crocheted doilies or knit doilies. You could use a vintage handkerchiefs and group them, you know, by a theme or by a color. Because there's a lot of beautiful options. Yes, they might have a few stains, but if you frame them, who's going to notice? Use vintage, again, vintage advertisements come in all different types of shapes and sizes. You could use vintage recipes. You could use vintage art out of old cookbooks. Vintage postcards, vintage photographs, anything that is vintage and will fit behind a frame, or not even, you know, it doesn't have to be a thin frame, it could be like a shadow box. It makes great art and you could hang it on your wall. You could also get vintage um, placemats and hang them on the wall. That's a great, interesting art piece. You could hang a vintage quilt or afghan if you wanted to. And of course, there are vintage options that are more affordable. If you check out my shop, I have the metal vintage butterflies. I have a vintage wall art. There's a lot of options when it comes to decorating with art. You just have to kind of use your imagination and know where to look. So guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. On Friday, we will be talking about how you can create vintage um, pieces yourself. Very easy, without a lot of money, and without a lot of time or trouble. So come back for that. I'll see you Friday. Bye-bye. <gasps>